Hi, it's Tuesday, June 6th at 8.30. It is time for Did You Know? Here's my fair use disclaimer. For copyright purposes, here is my entertainment only purpose for purposes only. Every week I try to bring you information about a famous person, and tonight is no different. We'll be talking about the incredible Tina Turner. Tina Turner was born as Anna May Bullock in Nutbush, Tennessee. She and Ike Turner rose to fame in the 1960s as a duo, and in the 1980s, she rose to fame on her own as the incredible Miss Tina Turner. Miss Tina passed away on May 24, 2023, at the age of 83. She was diagnosed in 2016 with intestinal cancer and also had to have a kidney transplant in 20. 17. Tina inspired generations of fans with her music and her resiliency. Miss Tina Turner will be missed. Thank you for all that you did and rest in peace, Miss Tina Turner. Next up, life hacks. I have several for you tonight. First up, from our uh, friend Lisa D, a wildlife tip. Always cut the plastic rings before throwing them away on your water bottles, your Coca-Cola bottles, even the plastic wrap on the outside of the case of water. Any plastic that may become constrictive on a wildlife animal and cause their demise, if we don't start taking care of our wildlife, we won't have any wildlife. Next up, a travel tip. Make sure you always take a, a quick photo of your luggage before traveling. This will speed up the process immensely if your luggage gets lost. Batteries, how do you tell if they're good? You drop a battery from six inches above the ground. If it bounces once and falls over, it's still good. If it bounces around more than that, then it is dead or on its way out. A way to watch free Disney movies, the original old Disney movies, go to cornell1801.com forward slash Disney forward slash movies dot html. And you'll be able to see all those great old Disney films. It's a great tip. Put a sticker with a fake pin number on your debit card. If you lose it and someone tries to use it three times, then the debit machine will keep the card. The Like the ATM machine will keep the card and then you will not have to worry about your account anymore. Don't want your personal data all over the internet? Go to accountkiller.com. You can remove it from a whole bunch of old and unwanted sites at once. Want someone to stop texting you? Send them this message. SMS message error 305. Message delivery failed. Further messages will be a charge to your account. Hopefully that'll stop them. You can go on namechk.com to see every website where your name username has been used then you can cancel those when you get a call from a telemarketer don't say anything and press 9 on your phone this will automatically add your number to their don't call list did you know that you can blur out your home on google maps you open google maps and type in your address and enter street view Tap the three dots and select report a problem. Drag a red box around your home and enter in why you want it blurred. This will take it so that when anyone looks up your home, all they see is blur. Spam text bothering you? Forward them to 7726 and your carrier will reply asking for the number it came from so they can help stop the spam. I've been using that one and it does work. 
when using your email to sign up for something but you never want to hear from them again add plus spam to the end of your user name Ex excuse me example 1000 five hacks plus spam at gmail.com this will send all emails from them to your spam folder and still treat it like a real email so you still get to sign up for whatever it was you were signing up for but you don't have to hear from them again oh that's a duplicate sorry along the way app will give you any cool attraction you can see along the way on any road trip that's along the way app. When calling customer service and getting an automated system, press the pound sign over and over again. It forces the system to connect you to a human. And as promised, here's the iPhone hacks. First, five iPhone codes you probably don't know about. To hide your caller ID from one call, you do pound three one pound and then the phone number to get your IMEI number it's star pound o oh six pound get that number off your phone and write it down and leave it somewhere at home if you ever lose your phone or it's lost or stolen you can you will need that number to help uh, find your phone display your signal strength as a number I don't know why you'd want to, but if you did, it is star 3001 pound 12345 pound star. To do call forwarding, you do star pound 21 pound. And call waiting is star pound 43 pound. All right, how to retrieve deleted text messages? Well, there's three ways. First, you can contact your service provider and ask for your call history, or you can go to your latest iCloud backup, or you can try a third party tool, backup tool, but that those cost money. How do you transfer the phone to a new phone before deleting everything off your old phone? First, make sure you do an iCloud backup. I was not even aware there was such a thing, and I did not have my phone turned on to do the backups, but I do now. Then you put both phones side by side. You wait for the quick start screen on your old device. Then you choose the Apple ID you want to use. An animation will appear on the new phone and you hold your current phone over the new phone centering the animation in the viewfinder. Finish on new device and it will prompt you to sign in and manage the settings on the new phone. Then you can restore your data and apps from your iCloud backup. How to delete all your personal information before trading in your phone? You go to settings, select your name, then tap iCloud and then iCloud Backup, sign out of all your apps, and then remove your SIM card. Once you have safely backed up and transferred, then do a factory reset by going to Settings, Reset, Select Erase All Contents and Settings. How to restart a frozen iPhone. You press and release the Volume Up button, Quickly and then quickly press and release the volume down button and then press and hold the side button. Release the button when the Apple logo appears. The main reasons iPhones freeze, low available storage space, infrequent iPhone boots, uninstalled updates, or it's just problematic or buggy. Blocked? How can you tell if someone has blocked you? Well, if your text messages don't get delivered, and you can also call and see if you get a recorded message. Sometimes you will. Sleep timer. Did you know there's a sleep timer on your iPhone? I didn't. You go to timer, scroll down all the way to the bottom, select stop playing when timer ends, then set a timer, enjoy listening, and it will stop when the timer goes off. 
and then you can, you know, you'll probably be already be asleep anyway. How do you hide photos on your phone from anyone? You go to photos, you select the photo options, select hide. Photo will be put in a hidden album. Then you just look under hidden album and that will require a fingerprint to open. Zoom on, zoom off, turning on your magnifier. You go to settings, accessibility, magnifier, to turn off, you tap on the screen with three fingers two times. Can pre-installed apps be deleted? Yes. If you do not use them, you definitely can delete them. And how to free up storage space? Delete downloads. You go to settings, general, iPhone storage. Then click the arrows next to the app and see how much space it is using and any downloads you don't need and delete them. How can you delete your email messages? Yes, if you're like some people who don't delete them daily, you may have a large backlog. You can go to delete email messages, go to settings, messages, then tap on keep messages under message history banner. Choose a time frame, 30 days, a year, or a lifetime, and the messages will be deleted on this time frame. Be on the lookout for Andro Android phone hacks to be coming soon. Thank you for watching. Please share this video, like the video, and subscribe to my channel. Good night.